my name's Janelle Cahoon and I'm an Australian born in Brisbane before then getting a full-time job with the Australian Opera and then travelling to Frankfurt and sing, singing with the Frankfurt Opera before going blind from the complications of diabetes which I'd had since I was age 10 and was ignoring most of the time pretending I didn't have it, hiding it so I didn't lose my job. I was fully aware that diabetes could learn, lead to blindness, but that would happen to someone else. And he'd said to me, if you don't get better control of your diabetes, you'll be dead by the time you're 30. And I went, okay, so if I'm gonna be dead, I'm gonna be dead, no worries. That's the way you think when you're a 17 year old, I'm just gonna go out and party really hard. I'm gonna push everything to the limit. I'm going to travel the world like I want to do. I'm going to pursue this career as an opera singer that I really want to do. He didn't say you're going to reach 30 and you're going to start suffering, you're going to go blind, then your kidneys are going to fail, you're going to have all sorts of neuropathies, you're going to have other diabetes complications. It's going to completely ruin your your life, so to speak, with the career, with the travelling, with the independence. And going blind at the age of 29, that took away my career, which was so important to me. It took away my independence, it took away driving my car around Europe, travelling. I was suicidal. I was depressed. I was angry. I was frustrated. They then just said, well, you'll need this scatter laser treatment. Just putting your chin on this, this headrest and having someone playing Space Invaders with the eyes, just shooting the back of your eye. And some of them weren't too painful and some of them were unbelievably just snappy head back. Once it's settled down, come back in a month, we'll check in, but we'll have to book in for surgery because they can't do laser treatment right over the macula. I think overall the doctors could have done a lot better job on a, in a lot of areas. On the other hand, I think they were brilliant. Like, I know they were trying their best. I know because I know my friend said, you know, when they go home at night, Janelle, they're not thinking about you and the pain you're going through. And I said, I think they are actually. There's now an injection rather than laser treatment, for one thing, is huge. Of course, there, I think there's gonna be people who, the idea of an a, um, injection in your eyeball is horrendous and I would have thought the same thing. So I think it's a, going to be a case of doctors really stressing that, you know, that laser treatment is painful. It doesn't work anywhere near as well. Go for the injection in your eye. I think everyone should be educated about DME, they think of it still as someone elderly will go blind and they're not really focusing on that it can happen to really young people. The thing is that a lot of people aren't putting the patient at the centre. It should also be including the patient from the beginning.